New Zealand's wanted list just got bigger. It wants to rid itself of millions of possums, rats and stoats eating their way through its native birds and harming the country's prized dairy and forestry industries. On the front line of the battle at Bottle Rock Peninsula, Duncan Kay leads a team of forest rangers trialling deadly techniques, including lures, traps and sensors. So we've basically got a social and a food lure here, so it's basically making it look like a bit of a rat home. This peninsula is where explorer James Cook first landed on his 1770s discovery voyages. He may have brought the first rats to the islands, and they found the country's ground-dwelling birds easy prey. Stoats in particular have really hammered the native species, so they're driving extinction really at the end of the day. If we want to have our forests, um, so our trees, our plants, our birds, our lizards, all of our native species, then we really need to figure out how to get rid of these things. New Zealand has set an ambitious goal of getting rid of all rats, possums and stoats by 2050, something no other country has succeeded in doing. The country has a global reputation for totally eliminating predators on small islands. So that is the old one, that's the new one. Yes. At this laboratory outside Lincoln, staff at Zero Invasive Predators, or ZIP, are developing cheap heat sensing cameras to scatter in forests and detect nocturnal hunters. Once found, drones could in the future be sent to drop poisons. Out in the field, ranger Briar Cook hammers a tea strainer the size of a ping pong ball against a tree with a ramp for inquisitive possums that leads up to a hidden trap. New Zealand's Department of Conservation says it's trying to make killing as humane as possible but without the campaign, the country's treasured wildlife will continue to be wiped out. Is that what New Zealand wants to be known for? The killers. <laughs> and uh, there's the negative side of that, that, you know, we are killing things. But there's the positive side of that, that it's actually not about the killing, it's about the protecting. <laughs>